All right, welcome. Welcome to Cyberpunk 2077. Uh, this is going to be a series that I'm going to start. I'm, well, we're going to play through all of Cyberpunk. Uh, I might even do a few extra playthroughs to go through all of the different storylines, potentially, based on your starting character. Uh, I've already played a little bit of Cyberpunk 2077 on stream, but uh, we're going to do this whole series off stream. It's all going to be done... Just you and I. Nice and simple. You know, we're not going to have any uh, any unwanted intrusions. We're going to be focusing wholeheartedly on the story here. Now, we have to play this game in very hard. That's just a given. I need a challenge. Now, when I started off for the first time, I went with Street Kid, and that was a really cool background. And I think Nomad's also a really cool idea. But uh, I think we're going to give Corporate Suit a try. We're going to be a total piece of shit. That's right. Um, we're gonna go with a man for this playthrough. Why not? Actually, you know what? Screw it. We went with a man last time. We're gonna actually go with a woman. Let's do it. Why not? Let's see what some of the alternative character customization options are. Alright, so we've got a lot that we can work with here in this game. Um, you've got a few presets here, just to give you an idea of what you can possibly do. But they've even got a randomized button, which I like. It's a, it's a cool way to get a nice idea of what the options are. Hopefully give you a bit of inspiration to work with. I want to do something a little bit out there. Yeah, I like the hair like that with that color. That's pretty awesome. They've only got two voice types. Female or masculine. Uh, feminine or masculine, I mean. Uh, they've got a lot of different skin tones here, as you can see. Fair few to choose from. Nothing uh, totally outlandish, though. I think we'll be, uh, we'll be kind of dark there. A little bit tan, perhaps. A lot of different hairstyles to choose from as well. Ooh, I do like that hairstyle. That is a pretty cool one. It's a little bit like the Miley Cyrus hair. But, uh, it's got that extra little stuff in the front there. There's a lot to choose from here. A whole lot of styles. I'll just go through them to give you guys an idea of what we're working with. A quick flick through them. I haven't really looked at all the female ones. They're definitely different from the uh, the male ones, although some of them double up, like the mohawk. You got the crew cut. Oh yeah, I like that. <laughs> that is pretty pretty intense. Although I don't think it's for me with this hairstyle or with this hair color. I mean, yeah, that one's also pretty cool. We definitely want to go with something out there. You know, we're uh, we're in the future, and look, we're also uh, we're a corporate suit. But we're so far up the ranks that we can wear our hair however we damn well please. We don't have to conform to any of the societal standards. So we can just uh, go with something much more out there just to prove our dominance over everyone else. Yeah, I think we're going to settle for this hairstyle. What colors can we go with? Honestly, that green one was a really nice color. Yeah, I like that a lot. I don't know if we're going to choose anything over that, to be honest. I'm just going to do a quick flip through some of the different colors here. Ooh, I do like that. That is actually also quite cool. We might end up going with that. Ooh, that dark blue with the red tips is also quite nice. I like the way that they've done this, how you don't have, like, just solid colors. You have blends as well with some of these. Yeah, I think we're gonna go with this, actually. Um, skin type? Okay, so it's kind of just, like, rough skin versus, like, blemishless skin. I think we're gonna be blemishless, nice, nice, uh, blemish-free for us. Uh, we've done our hair color. Let's do our eyes, shall we? There's some really cool eye types you can have in here. Or pupil types, anyway. These, however, I don't think make a massive difference, but I do like the fact that you can see them sort of shift into their position. Rather than just being, uh, I think we're gonna go with that one. Rather than just being, um, like, a sudden sw switch. I like the way it morphs. Now, this is what I really like. So, you have the standard variety of uh, interesting colors you can choose from, but then they have some unusual modifications that you can have to your eyes. Last time what I went with was these hypnotic swirls. I thought that was pretty damn cool. Um, ooh, I do like the predator sort of eyes there. The eye of Sauron. Death in my eyes. The last thing that the enemy sees. I could also go with that. No, no, we'll go spider webs. I like the spider web design. No, I don't think the inverted spiderweb is good. I think we're going to go with this one. Because that's just a target. That just makes it easy for them to shoot me in the eyes. So I don't think that's going to be a good one. Um, Alright, now we go for the eyebrows. 
You can get rid of eyebrows. I remember the eyebrows not being too impactful for the men. I imagine it's similar things here. Yeah, they're all pretty straightforward. You know what? Screw it. We don't believe in eyebrows. We don't want people to be able to read our expressions. We are a corporate suit, and not having eyebrows has thus made it more difficult for others to read our intentions and made doing dirty dealings a whole lot easier. So that's what we're going with there. I feel like with this person, we want like a subtle nose. We don't want anything that's too overpowering. We just want something that's, uh, you know, j just there. It's not like eye catching. It's not huge. It's not, it's not taking up a lot of the face. It's just, it's just a little, little thing right in the center of our, of our face. That's what we're looking for here. Yeah, that one looks pretty good. I like that. It's kind of pushed in a little bit, a little scrunched up. All right, what, what kind of mouth options do we have here? So when they say mouth, I think what they mean here is lips, really. Lips, for the most part. I think, again, like the nose, we're going to go for something quite small here. Quite suppressed. We don't want massive lips that take up the face. Ooh, I did kind of like the, that pout. Was that the pout? Yeah, that kind of looks like a pout. A little small pout there. That, that fits. I like that. Let's go again. We're going to have a very small face. We don't want a massive, thick jawline. I like, I'm fine to have a defined jawline, but I want it to be a, quite a thin face overall. Kind of going with the whole theme here. We're looking for the sort of petite look here. That's what I'm thinking. We don't want it to be like very sharp. I feel like what we were looking for is round. But yeah, that one's pretty good. I think we're going to stick with that. What ear options do we have here? Again, I think small ears. That's going to be the general theme of this character. Petite and small. We don't want anything that's just huge and uh, attention grabbing. Yeah, I think those ears are good. I don't think the ears make a massive difference. But can you remove ears? That's the real question. We can't remove ears. Dang. De ears are indeed required. Uh, I guess we're going to have to cop it. But <laughs> such is life. Alright, I think... Which were the ears that I looked at before that I liked? Oh, I went past them. I think that was it. Yeah, we'll go with those ones. So there's some really cool cyberware that you can get on your face and your body as well. It's not going to let us see the whole thing, is it? No, it's not. It's not going to let us see. Some of them go for along the neck as well, as you can see, but can't really get a good look at them. There's not too many of them, unfortunately, but I think we're going to go for... Yeah, I kind of like that one. And again... Maybe we've just avoided getting any on our face. Yeah, maybe that's good. It's kind of like on the side, hidden by the hairstyle. We don't want to give away to any other corporate executives what kind of cyberware that we're rocking. So we've sort of hidden it a bit behind our hair. We've got a few facial tattoos. Yeah, I think we can get away, get away with a few facial tattoos. We're at that point in our career where we've just, uh, like I said, we've gone above and beyond all the other suits and we can choose what we what we wear without worrying about judgment from other co corporate executives facial scars huh I don't think we want any facial scars we might have some cool face tattoos though now there is a bit of an, I an issue here where occasionally it'll just jump back up to the top of the menu so you're just gonna have to bear with me on this one this is one of the early kinks that's still being worked out from the game so we're just gonna have to live with that. Yeah, I like that neck tattoo. Goes around the sides as well. Got skulls on it. Yeah, let's do that. Even this, is that a flower in there as well? Yeah, it looks kind of, kind of like a floral pattern. These piercings are good. I do like the piercings that we've got going on here. Just a simple little nose ring. I like the eyebrow one, honestly. Yeah, double eyebrows. Ear stud. Another stud. Yeah, I can get behind that. Got the spider bites. Got an earring, got a stud there on the side of the head, another stud, or oh, two studs on that side. Alright, yeah, I can get behind that as well. I feel like the double, oh, the double brow, but that one's kind of hidden, so I don't think it works as well. I think we want the double brow piercing from before. Yeah, I like that one. That's good. We're going with that. You can also choose your teeth in this game. You can have golden teeth. I feel like, look, I'm so rich, I can afford it. Why not? What other teeth options do we have there? It's kind of like bronze, is it, I guess? It's like a red... Actually, the red one kind of goes with my aesthetic for the hair color. I think we'll go with the red. What other ones can we have, though? Just regular old. Yeah, we can go with the red. Eye makeup. 
The eye makeup, I think, needs to be pretty heavy. We want to draw them to the spider webs within the eyes. That's my thinking. That's one of our most eye-catching features. Everything else here is pretty muted. It's, uh, it's designed to be small, not to draw your attention to it, but the eye makeup is going to bring your attention to these spider web eyes. That's the idea. I think that was the best one for it. I think we want black eye shadow. Yeah, we've already got the darkest one. Let me just check. Oh, we could go with a lighter color to sort of complement the reds we've got going on here. Yeah. Kind of like that color as well. Yeah, I, I, I like that one. It's kind of like the bluey gray. I don't really know what to call that. I suppose it's like a gray blue. Uh, we might have a bit of lip makeup. Why not? What choices do we have here? Ooh, I do like the one where we've got a strike through it, because that kind of fits what we've been doing with our hair. That's also quite nice. Having one, Yeah, and I think we're going to go with one of each color here. We want one that matches our, our color scheme that we're going here with here. Oh, that's awesome, though. In all fairness, the shiny gold there. I think the matching color scheme was that. Yeah, that, that's probably the closest. Not that one, right? Yeah, no, that doesn't fit so well. I think that's probably what we want to match the color scheme. A bit of cheek makeup. What sort of cheek makeup could we be working with? It's very subtle, cheek makeup. Very subtle. That one heightens the jawbone. Makes it look much more profound. Or the cheekbone, I should say, not the jawbone. I think we'll probably want the red color, right, if we're doing this. Oops. Hmm. It's kind of like freckles that we're giving there. Yeah, I think that's the one we go for. Kind of give the rosy cheek look. Blemishes. Well, we did opt for the blemish-free face, so maybe we're not going to have any blemishes. Let's see where these blemishes even are. Oh, I see. They're kind of just like spots and freckles in the face. Yeah, no, we're gonna have. We're not gonna have any of them. We're not gonna bother with that. Yeah, we gotta have long nails. All right. Well, look. There is uh, a few things that we're gonna have to do here for YouTube. Unfortunately, this game is uh, <laughs> it is R18, and YouTube will not allow a lot of what can be seen within this game. So that you guys are gonna see a lot of black boxes that are saying a little too saucy for YouTube because these things most certainly are too saucy. But you can still see here that we've got our black fingernails, or long fingernails that I think are going to be black. I don't know, well, actually there's a lot of colours in here, you get a lot of different colours compared to the ones I was off- Oh no, these are actually the same ones I was offered as a man, I take it back. Uh, I think we want to go for something that sort of matches the aesthetic that we're working with though. Ooh, that's, that's kind of close. It's the one we just had to start with. Actually I think that works out pretty cool, the polka dots there. I like a lot of these patterns. I wish you could choose the pattern and then choose a color scheme for the patterns. That'd be an interesting touch. Gives you a little bit of extra variety. Although the nails are probably something you're not really going to notice while you're playing through the game, but it is still a nice little touch that we could add. Just a little bit of feedback there. Yeah, no, I think that works pretty well. The purple and black. We do have a little bit of black in our aesthetic. Uh, what else could it be? These are very glossy. Look at the shine on these. Yeah, I think we'd go with the purple and black. So there's also a variety of options here as well. You can choose your chest size from default, small or big. Although you guys don't really get access onto that. Uh, we're just gonna leave it at default. Nothing, nothing too important. You can even choose whether or not. Oh, you can choose a variety of nipple types. When you're a guy, uh, you only had one choice. You either could have nipples or no nipples. Uh, we're actually going to remove our nipples, because theoretically, now we've removed these nipples, this should be totally A-OK -okay with YouTube, right? Because, uh, look, if it were male nipples, then we, we would be fine, but now that we've removed the female nipples, these breasts are actually A-OK. -okay. Uh, that is, that is the lore of the world. Um, I like the body tattoos we're working with. Yeah, I think we got the full body tattoo set there, number one, that was pretty cool. Like, that covers a lot of us, but I feel like this one with all the different designs is way cooler. We also choose body scars. Uh, we haven't got any scars. We've actually had a pretty successful time, uh, successful run as a suit. I haven't got into any toughs. We uh, rough and tumbles. We've been uh, letting the street thugs handle our business. Now, you can also mess around with your genitals here. You can have a penis if you want as a woman or 
you know, or a vagina, or you can just turn it off. We're just going to leave it off just so uh, we don't have to worry about uh, YouTube and various scenes where we might end up naked. It just saves me a little bit of effort, but that setting is there, and I do appreciate the fact that that setting is there. Uh, so since we've turned that off, we can't choose the penis size or the pubic hair options, but, you know, not really relevant for us. Uh, although I know they do have a, f a great variety of settings in there. You can choose uh, to various shapes and colors. You can dye your pubes. Why not? You know, I like the extra uh, extra little options there. Now, how are we going to go through the game this time around? Last time I played, I was a pistol uh, slinger and a sniper. And I really did enjoy that. So I think we're going to opt for that again. So we're going for crit hit chance. We get... We gotta look pretty cool, like we are a pretty cool character already with an aesthetic like this. Uh, we gotta add a little bit of extra health, we're gonna need that. Um, technical ability I didn't see is too important, and same with intelligence. But yeah, I think cool and reflexes were the ones that I thought were most important. And then we'll go for a bit of extra body. Oh. Yeah. Nah, no, we'll just go cool. Max out the cool. Hell to the air. So I think we're all happy with our character now, we're gonna lock this all in. We're called V. Uh, Victoria, that's what we go by, I suppose. I don't actually know. I know they, at some point, tell you what V is short for in the male name, but I wonder if it's different for the field male, female name. We'll see. Uh, so, the corpo life is few leave the corporate world with their lives, fewer still with their souls intact. You've been there, you've bent the rules, exploited secrets, and weaponized information. There's no such thing as a fair game, only winners and losers. Damn straight. Let's get into it, shall we? Just the loading screen here. So, honestly, like the graphics on this though, look, uh, it almost looks like, like a legitimate uh, piece of hardware that I'm looking at here. You'd never think this is all just animated. It's pretty crazy how far graphics have come these days. All dressed up, ready for a day. Oh, about to throw up, nice. Oh, lovely. I'm getting a call as well. Give me a moment, Jackie. V, Give me a moment. You there? Yeah, I'm here. Yeah. Wait, what is it? <clears throat> yeah, I'm here. You all right? I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> needed a breather. Sounded like you blew your guts airlock. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I barfed. It's just stress. Understandable. Uh, a chamba te va a matar. Everyone's a critic. Not dead yet. Somebody, uh, somebody turned coat. Gave up our agents. I uh, will just go with the hey, joke. Don't worry. Will there be? Not dead yet. Exactly. Yet. Give it time. Give it anyway, time. It'll get us. What's going on? Is there a problem? What does this guy want? Yeah, that's what I thought. Keep walking. We had a leak. My boss called. Dragged me in because we had to intervene. Everyone at Night City HQ is on edge. But no way she fucked, right? You're the one who fixes other people's shit. Jackie, if you work in Arasaka Counter Intel, you're always fucked. Yeah, that doesn't sound good. Um, no, just tell him to worry. I don't want Jackie to don't worry, worry about, about me. Don't worry about me. I'll manage on my own. I'm a fucking suit, a corpo. I'm sure I'll be right. First time in Night City? No, let's carry on. We don't need to read those tips. Can we grab our pills, though? No, we don't need those anymore. We kind of puked on them a little bit. It's fine. We're just gonna leave the puke there. We have uh, we have uh, service stuff to clean that up, so I don't have to worry about that shit. Um, really nice building we work in, though. Real, real nice. Like this is definitely top tier. What are these guys doing? Repenting for your sins or in meditation? I don't know. I'll just say. You think Japan will find out? Find out what? About what? Yeah, exactly. About Frankfurt. I mean, it's a small leak, but still. The fuck? Keep Japan your voice down. Knows. They already know? You hear this? Assume Japan knows everything. It's safest that way. It's an interesting point of view. Just act like they've already known, and then just work around that fact. Plan your schedule around that. Uh -oh. That guy looks a little pompous. He looks like he's got his head in the clouds. Why are these guys looking at each other? That's the most awkward thing you can do ever do in an elevator. Christ, V, you were supposed like, to be here an hour ago. Yeah, I'm working on it. 
Oh. Got held up, but I'll be right there. Almost there. Fucking Frankfurt. That Abernathy bitch will probably dump it in our laps. Ugh. Hanging on. I'll be in my office. You hurry up. Is this not like the most awkward thing you can ever do in an elevator? Like, when I go into an elevator, I just look off, I don't stare at people. These guys are just looking at each other. That's just weird. They've even got televisions here that you can be looking at, but instead they're just staring at each other. Militech hit three of ours. Three of them? Now we're evacuating the rest of our facilities in that part of Europe. What's the status of the three? They're dead. Well, Once fuck. everyone else is safe, we'll issue a statement to the media. Saying what? A tragic accident during routine security system maintenance would be my bet. Right, well that doesn't sound good. Sounds like my company is having some hard times. He's been ages. What are you trying to say to me? I'm getting talked to by two people at once here. It's me, confusing. Frank. Hey Frank. Drink Icefall. Oh yeah, Icefall, Icefall. of course. Dude, you got like some golden little flares there under your eyes. Uh, I'm in a rush, Listen, Frank. Sorry, I'm in a bit of a rush right now. We'll talk another time, okay? Sure, sure. Good seeing you again. Yeah, good seeing you, Frank. Uh, I don't give a shit about you. Uh, I've got a job to do, and I could not give a shit about some dude I met nice for. But you know, I do have time to listen to these people. If they have anything interesting to say. Uh, when I go through this game, I feel like it's best to listen to some of the side NPC talks. You get a lot of good insight about what's going on in the world if you just take a little bit to hear what's going on around you. Oh, they're just scanning me, huh? Making sure I'm not carrying anything I shouldn't be carrying. Are you online? Have a seat, V. Be right with you. That I shall. You have to handle this. I'm stressing out. My my legs are weak. Bases in the sea of clouds. Oh shit! We're about to begin. What's the situation? Whole corporation. Hmm. Am I uh, am I meant to be here? Am I that mm -hmm. high up in the world? Yeah, just as we thought. Apparently so. You know what to do. Start now. Oh shit. We're killing off people in the European Space Council. Apparently. Director Abernathy. I watched the vote. What the hell was that? A deep clean after the shit Frankfurt dumped on us. As we agreed. I got rid of the problem. He did get rid of it. I told you to resolve the problem, not massacre the European Space Council. Do you understand what the cover-up will cost? We would have lost the license. Now we gained a week. That's a win. Path of least resistance always. No nuance has you written all over it. <laughs> We're not Look at that fucking hand. About this. Yeah, it's just a little massacre. She takes these things too seriously. I hate that bitch. I always have. Yeah, fuck that bitch. It's not the first time she screwed you. This isn't the first time Abernathy set you up. No, not the first. Eh, fuck that she bitch. Me in front of Japanese execs, so she'd be the one promoted to director of spec ops. Exactly. Now she's holding a gun to my head to make sure I don't try anything. But she won't pull the trigger because she. Oh, look at that water. Or that I do what she alcohol, does. I should say that water. Divide and conquer. Effective strategy. You know it. Effective. No, you what think will so? you do in my position? You have defend to defend yourself. yourself. Remind Abernathy you're not her doormat. Stand you're up for yourself. Right. Smack her once, but hard. She'll respect you. Seems we see eye to eye on this issue. That we do. What do you got there? Take this. What is this? A data shard? Data shard. Proof of my trust. Go on. Take it. Alright. Let's see what you got. Let's just uh, put this into it's our what cranium. I've collected over the past weeks. Biometrics. Trauma team card. Names of her closest associates. Driver. Chief of security. Lover. Lover's husband. Whole lot of information. Use it. And make sure Abernathy won't be a problem anymore. You said right. it. I need to defend myself. If anyone finds out we even talked about this, I'll go down with you. That's true. But everyone knows you only made it to where you are thanks to me. 
All right, so it's not well, like they could ever believe you played no part in it. That's a fair enough point. If uh, my whole career has been riding on you, Jenkins. What will happen if I refuse? Don't ask stupid questions. Fair this enough. This isn't a request. V. It's an order. Yeah, we I get seem it. seem to understand each other. Take this, too. Alright. Can't go wrong with cash. Friendship can you? transactions are traceable. Paper disappears as soon as you spend it. What can I say? Smart man. Use Let's, this money uh, only. Find the right people for the job. No corporate. Let's do that. And for the core right, task, can do. use someone you know inside out. Are we clear? Yeah. I think Damn, we're clear. I'm, I'm pretty good. rich. Do you just see my In money? Case, I've been doing I'll well for myself. Report. And good luck with it. Can do, Jenkins. I have my AV waiting outside. It's yours to use. Sweet and don't ass. disappoint me. You know I never do, Jenkins. Lean in, Jenkins, sly, flirtatious wink. We have a, a special kind of connection, Jenkins and I. There's a reason I, have I am his right-hand woman. And I'll have you know, it's not oh, just my ruthless you know, corporate strategies. Although, you know, some hey, might say that is a you ruthless cor corporate strategy I'll in itself. In oh, it ain't good, Jackie. Yeah. Viper pit. Yeah. Couldn't have said it better. You in some trouble? You know it, boys and need a soul I can trust for now. That kinda sounded like a yes. The world's never me a Lizzie's. Be there in an hour. I ain't good at Lizzie's. They won't know it for long. Am I going the wrong way? I guess it must be hidden the wrong way. Yeah, we're meant to be going this way. It's the trouble, you kinda just have to stand around with some of these calls. They don't tell you preemptively where you need to go. Well, and that was the long way it was just giving me there. It's in here. I need your stamp on something. It's possible one of our assets was exposed. Oh shit! Is this about Frankfurt? Is it Frankfurt again? No, different issue. Local. Tell me, quick version. Our agent at Biotechnica suspects they might be onto him. They recently granted oh, him shit. red security clearance. That's top. He's been fishing for dirt, but it's been slow. Your point. They're clean. Like we run orphanages clean. Shit. Bleach server clean. We suspect they flagged him and are feeding him phony data. Oh, Should we damn. green light Xville or let him keep looking? Projected risks. Yeah. Limited threat to life. Not biotechnica style. Blackmail's possible. Leveraged against false accusations in the media. The guy has kids. He'd crack. Pull him out. We can't risk to have him Pull in there. Him out. But calmly, don't raise any eyebrows. Otherwise, they'll catch on. Jenkins will be livid. I'll handle Jenkins. That's what I gotta Understood. do. <laughs> like honestly, we don't want getting into any, we don't want us getting into any bigger issues here. Alright, that's my office job, is it? Nice. Uh, open the drawer. What's in the drawer? Pick up the card. I think that's important. I guess. Probably need that something or other. No, we're just going to take a quick look at that. Uh, let's just use the cognitive booster. If we're doing our job, we want to be uh, whew, right in the zone. Now we're good to go. Now we are set. Yeah, I may be a slight drug addict. That might have also helped me get to my uh, <laughs> get to my current position. Report summary. What's this about? After assessing data collection from contact reports in Utah, Nevada, Arizona, and Montana, we did not confirm any active Noosa efforts against uh, Arasaka assets or operations in federal territories. Okay, so that's nice. Uh, however, oh, plot thickens. The same collusion cannot be drawn regarding potential threats from Militech. Alright, so Militech's on our ass. Although the corporation has obvious, uh, obvious close ties to the Noosa government, uh, we are unable to obtain valuable intel due to the much tighter control on intel, internal uh, pro uh, procedure, and information flows. We must rely on unconfirmed uh, circumstantial evidence obtained by our own field agents for the, this time being. Hmm. Conclusion. Further hummit, hum, hummint uh, of gathering required. Current data are uh, circumstantial and do not allow for indist... Uh, Indisputable bleh, conclusions. Reading my strong suit, as you can all see. Am I even meant to be here? Is this what I'm meant to be doing? Like, hold on. Am I? Am I? 
Why am I even on here? Am I meant to be on the internet? Like, hold on. Let me just jump off. Let's stand up. I know I just I just took some uh, stuff from my job. But... Oh. I guess we were meant to be in here? I don't know. Maybe I should have read those messages rather than reading that little file. Dude, what is that guide? What is it? What is it re it's leading me over here. Should I hear what these guys are saying? They look pretty, pretty distraught. He's not happy with this file, is he? What's on it? Can we even read that if we get... It's too small for us to read. <laughs> it's, don't mind me just jumping on your table. Alright, we got a job to do. We gotta get the fuck out of here. We get scanned in between each and every room? Oh, I see. Ooh, that's what I'm taking out, is it? Nice. We were riding around in luxury, no doubt. Please provide your destination. Is there a way to get some wine? Bring up district analysts. Yeah, we should probably know what we're getting into. Increased NCPD presence and activity has been reported in Haywood. No official statement has been forthcoming. Right. Intercepted radio communications suggest MaxTac has been sent to the area. A of widespread power failure has been reported in Santo Domingo. All other districts exhibit Whew. activity within expected parameters. It's the future and we're still having power failures? Man, things aren't good. Can I get some of that champagne? Noted. Unmoved. Yes, I can! Yes, please. Man, being a corpo has its privileges. Let's turn the news on. This is M54 News broadcasting a with a breaking uh, story for you. We don't know a conference of the film. European Space Council screeched to a grisly halt following a failure in the neural stabilization system. Five Thanks. European Space Council Lovely. members are dead while three get another drink? in critical condition. Authorities are still I want more than just a buzz. I want to get like completely blackout drunk for my job. Is that not possible? The corporation's representatives have as yet refused to comment. Uh, that ain't good. Dude, that alcohol's already kicking. Look at that. This uh, this whole thing's uh, shaking it out. Or wavering. It's a pretty nice skyline that we're looking at here. Body without limits, huh? Of course. Everyone needs one of them. Life coach? Of course I have a life coach. Let's see what he has to tell me, or she. Hello, v. Hello yes. life coach. We weren't scheduled to connect until the end of the week. Quantified Satori received notification of a somewhat troubling biometric reading. I felt oh. I should call. What's that? Is everything in order? Things are on, only alright. Dealing with a temporary nuisance. Yeah. Just think back to our last session. Of course. The neuromotor relaxation exercises three times a day, they'll soothe and lift your spirit. I know this. Sure, right. okay. See you later. What was the last exercise we did? Breathing exercises? <laughs> oh man, I'm feeling relaxed now. <laughs> Only a little bit more of this and I'm just gonna be <laughs> so <laughs> relaxed. Oh god, I want to scream. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why that isn't working. Somehow, uh, breathing exercises aren't doing it for me. <laughs> and I'm actually feeling kind of stressed out after that. Like myself and my character. As close as you can. Fuck procedures. Initiating landing sequence based on new parameters. Alright, sweet. I think, uh, yeah, that's, uh, that's Lizzie's down there. Nice. You know what kind of place we're getting into. You can see the axe, and you can see the leg, and what looks to be a very scantily clad individual. Where is this gonna land? Are we going around the roof, are we? We have arrived at your destination. Fuck's your problem, Psycho Suit! This look like a landing pad to you. Could have fucking, fucking crushed us. You fucking what? You fucking what? Bro, okay, no, no, hey, we, we ain't looking for no beef with you. Uh, look, could have fooled me. Could have fooled me. Ain't looking for no beef. You better fucking Leave watch. Me alone. You better fucking check it before you fucking stand up to somebody like me. Oh, what was that? Oh, let's take a quick oh, shot as well. Why is this happening? And we're on point today. 
What are these guys doing? Chilling out here having a smoke. Yes? What's up? Alright, don't wanna chat, that's fair. Hey bouncer. Oh, uh, keep an eye on the AV. Keep an eye on the AV for me, will you? I don't get paid to do that. I, I wasn't asking. And not a scratch on it when I get back. <laughs> Welcome to Lizzie's. <laughs> there you go. I have that kind of power, do I? Shit. It's pretty crazy. What's going on over here? Y'all just chilling? I have a tiger, smoke? babe. Oh, I just talked to him and he dropped whatever he was eating. Sorry about that, bro. Ooh, nice. We're up on the top level. It's the VIP area, right? Everybody out here dancing, huh? How y'all doing? What do you want, friend? Just saying hi. What's going on over here? What's your problem? I'm off the clock. Alright. Shit, I get it. I get it, buddy, man. What's back here? Dude, this is the DJ's area? Alright, let's just take that. Why not? We're, uh, we're a corporate executive. We can take whatever the damn hell we please. Who's gonna tell us no? Yeah, I can just walk into the DJ's room and, uh, she doesn't give a fuck. She doesn't know something to fuck with, uh, corporate e executives. What kind of power you get? She's explaining something with no words. This is just, uh, just mining. Maybe she's actually deaf. I have a tiger, babe. No, she's not deaf. Uh, she's just choosing to use nothing but her hands for whatever reason. Dude, everyone's smoking inside. Why'd those guys go outside for a smoke? I suppose that was just, uh... They felt like doing. Alright, we're back here now. Kind of done the old loop de loop. Can't go these ways. Oh. Anything hidden back here? Nah, nothing hidden back here. Oh, hold on. Yeah, we'll take that. I don't know what that is. Actually, I think it's like a heel, so uh, should be should be well worth. How do we get down? Yeah, everyone here is very quiet. No one's here no one here is having conversations. They're all just sort of standing around. Even these people, they look like they're having a good time, but a very quiet good time. Don't come here often, do you? No, of course not, Jackie. I'm busy. Now sit down and tell me what's got your shorts in a knife. Yeah, sure. It's good we to see you that. too, Jack. How you been? We got sparks flying between the Valentino boys and Maelstrom. Eddie's there for the taking. Oh, as long yeah. as you don't get flatlined. Yeah, I'll look yeah, up a bit. Know how it is. Can't complain, but we ain't here to shoot the shit about me. We hear about this problem of yours. Waving a, that, oh, waving for if that person's asking him for drinks, huh? Jackie, before I start, this stays between us. It's very important. Supuesto. Serious. This thing, it it could ruin me. So could I. <laughs> you do realize who you're talking to, right? The guy who's done this before. Oh, Jackie knows Remember his what shit. happened in Mexico, the border. Keep one word. I know. Right, you saved my ass. Let's keep keep your mouth down about that. Right? Right? Looking... But it didn't. And this won't either. That's why you came to see dear old Jackie. Of course, Jackie, of course. We'll take a look at this. You need yeah, to see sure. this. Take it. And it's a virus. What do you think? Won't come cheap. It'll have to be done on the sly. No trail. Hard eddies only. Got the money. Full crew job for sure. Techie, maybe two. A runner with a gold-plated brain. And a driver with... Gold-plated brain? Not to mention a solo. Mm-hmm. The piece I'm missing. That what you need from me? My trigger finger to zero this lady? Uh, I need someone I can trust. Delicate situation, I know. That's why I need somebody I can trust. This ain't no delicate situation, Emma. It's a hit job. Plain and simple. You right. know how Arasaka operates. Or, okay, maybe you don't. This isn't a professional request I can refuse. But I can. And I am. And 
you should too. Now, Schatze. what do you say we lick her up and talk life? Gracias, mamita. Double I tequila with grenadine and lime. I don't think I can refuse this, though. Nothing better for drowning nerves. Fuck it. it Why is. not? I'm stressed out. I need a little more. What the hell does that even mean? You raise a glass to your mama, your hermana. To the mamacita you'll meet at the bar. But this doesn't say a damn thing. <laughs> to this. Jackie ain't happy. This job and all the rest of that corpo bullshit. You know what it is? Un pacto con el diablo. Deals a, a pact with the devil. All along. Mm. So you're a fuckers. Today, they got you to zero somebody. Tomorrow, they'll get somebody else to zero you. Just have a choice, bro. If I refuse, they take everything and leave me nothing. I will let them. They'll also take the fist they got gripping your balls. I don't know about you, but I'm pretty picky about who I let touch my balls. <laughs> so Burrow and his matones, oh, they definitely do not make the cut. Maybe someday, but for now, I'm still well within their reach. You'll always be within reach. Always. Re hey, you lost? Got a problem? Who the hell are these guys? V, is that right? Did Jenkins send you? Don't believe I know you. You don't, but we know you very well. Oh, dude. Jenkins assigned you a task today. You'll share all the details with us. Who are you again? Name and department again. Didn't quite catch it the first time around. <laughs> Fuck! How you feeling? Pretty sharp dive, huh? They take my money. Access to company networks is hereby revoked. Shit. In two minutes, any company cybernetics in your possession will cease function. Give us the data you received from Jenkins. This will conclude termination procedures. How'd you find out? How the hell did you find out? That is not your concern. God damn. The data now. All right, hand it over. <clears throat> Information's on the shore. Smart choice. God freaking damn it. <sighs> we done? With the formalities, yes. But I think Abernathy would gladly up our fee for ridding her of a piece of rock like you. Stand up. You're coming with us. Come on, move oh, it. Yeah, it. Fellas might have forgotten just how far from home you are. <laughs> Not sure this body was your style. Let alone a healthy option. Yeah, God. <laughs> <laughs> Jackie's my man. Maybe we join in, huh? Before you know it, somebody might die today. We have what we came for. Okay, that's what I thought. You better fucking... You better get the fuck out of here. Dude, Jackie's just staring him down. Dude, Jackie saved my ass once again, just like in Mexico. Ooh, one there. Uh, v, how you feel? You alright? Like shit. Like... <clears throat> like shit. I don't know what the hell they did to me. <clears throat> my throat's like sandpaper. I'm not sure I can breathe. It's like when my little primito was ditching drugs. <laughs> Nasty chills. Damn. Trembling hands. Cold sweat and dry even. Hey, yeah. Sounds about right. Hey. Hey. Should I get you to a ripper? It's probably or, a good idea. I guess. Maybe trauma team's on its way. TT policy's gone, Jack. So are my biochem controllers, company pad. I mean, they have ceased. My bank account not frozen, seized. Jesus, these fuckers move fast. You sure you feel okay though? I mean, give me a minute. I think we'll catch our breath. Together. We'll feel a little better. That'd be that, Jack. Just lost control of my life, completely. Yeah. I'd say you got it back. Yeah, well, the way you're talking Couldn't about it. I say no to him. So they said it to you. Damn. 
This is a turn for the better. Finally got the ball, the hand off my balls, just like Jackie said. I haven't lost everything. I have to say, I, I still have a friend. That's sweet. <laughs> <laughs> no, dumbass. You still got that wad for the hit job, don't you? Probably some fat ass chunk of cha chain. Just right for a new start. That's right, Chica. All right. Oh, well, we're doing all right at least. Hey, you hear got a bit right? of money. Don't look so hot. V, oh shit! I'm passing out. Hey, hermana. Your new life. It starts now. Hell to the yeah. The new life. We about to begin. We may have got fucked over by the corporation, but uh, hey, that ain't so bad. It could have been worse. He ain't, he ain't happy. He's just like getting walked into. We're gonna take that. See you very much. Oh. Looks like we're doing some jobs. Finally got my own car. Nice. Good set of wheels. She's got the similar kind of aesthetic to me, you know. Oh, we ain't letting that guy get away. No, -uh, not with Jackie around. Are we kicking it? <laughs> oh shit, now we're getting into a fight. Damn, we get beaten the fuck up. We lost a tooth. It's fine, we don't need that teeth any that tooth anyway. <laughs> oh shit, serious. That's what I thought. Got some grenades, got a rifle, got some pistols. Shit, yeah. We're ready to go. Oh damn, threw that shit right at him. I love that. So, I finally got myself a half decent place. Happy days. The city of dreams. The city of dreams, baby. Right where we want to be. I'd rather be in no city. We're looking for no other city. Building. Probably crawling with the pendejos that kidnapped her. Half of your Eyes and ears open, all right. Speaking of which, got you a little something. Little dick training shard. In case you need to uh, brush up on your dance moves. Down for no, some no. target practice in VR? I don't have enough time for this. No time. Maybe later. Sure, sure. Mañana. Mañana. I'm good to go. Let's, let's, do this. let's do this. Let's get out into there. Let's get the job done. There's no time for this kind of stuff. We can't just sit here and chat. We got a job to do. Elevator. This way. We got a pistol. Do we have any other weapons? I saw a rifle before. Do you have a rifle? No, we only got a pistol. That's fine. Let's call this elevator and let's get this job done. Oh, the elevator's good to go. Shit. There we go. Uh, it's not doing the thing. What do I have to do to interact with? Oh, it's just gonna do it automatically. Okay. I was pressing buttons, but nothing was happening. But, uh, there you go. Targets Sandra Dorset. Targets Biomon went mute a couple hours back. Suspected abduction. Target could have right. possibly flatlined already. Not sure you're in time. We're in time, Bug. Surely. We, sure you're on phones, but that don't make you any less part of this squad. Squad. Charming. <laughs> She's warm. Bug. Could at least try to be. Yeah, nice. come on now. You want nice, supportive? Call a damn helpline. Well, shit. She's, uh, she's cold. T-Bug ain't got no friendship. What's it say on the elevator there? I missed that. Maybe you guys can uh, catch it when you slow down the footage later. Some things I can grab? Yeah, nice. Ooh, more things I can grab. Take all that. Why not? I know we're in a hurry, but, uh... Looking for 1237. Target should be inside, but I got zero eyes on her bio mine. Fingers crossed it's not too late. Can we go in here? Oh, I hate this. We're gonna get back, back the hell in there. Hurry. Bro, I don't want. Can I come in there though? No, I can't come in there. <laughs> Try hacking the door. I hadn't tried that before, Think so until you. Let's thing? see. Is there anything else up there? Ooh, there, there is some stuff up here. I've never actually walked up here to find out. A few things you can grab. Ooh, yeah, may as well head back this way.
Oh yeah, you gotta hack the door. All right. That's the hacking menu just there. I'm gonna try and do a stealth, a stealth entry here. We don't really wanna let everyone know we're coming on in. Are we fucking late? Is that her? Damn. Is that our target? Is that our target? Sandra Dorset's protected under echelon two corporate immunity. Our girl's top shelf. This one's packing black market data tech repros. Typical back alley fix-ups. Not our lucky go. Let's keep looking. Just gonna grab everything in here. Might be something worthwhile. Find out later, I'm sure. Oh, uh, not the pendulums. Real quiet. I can do that. I can do quiet. This dude's not even listening. Look at him. He's in, the, he's in his own world. See you, bro. After my ruthlessness from six months ago, I've become a ruthless, cold-hearted killer. I know I am now remorseless about taking down others. I have no consideration for life. Six months has changed me drastically. I was already a ruthless corporate overlord, but now after everything that's happened, after getting backstabbed, I'm completely remorseless. Sounds good to me. Anything else back there? No, not that I can see. Ready to go. All down. We'll take that stuff. Are those guns any better than what we got? Nah, the revolvers. Less DPS, but uh, more headshot damage though. Let me go for the more headshot damage. I feel like let's uh, let's try and hit our shots here, shall we? Oh, this one's a little bit better for the headshot damage. Yeah, just a little bit more damage. We want that. Last of them. One. stealth mode. Pull this guy back and then knock him out. We don't want anyone to catch uh, catch sight of this. Get him out of here. Man, his uh, face is totally blurred. I guess that's what you need if you're some kind of criminal. We're gonna go for this guy. Jackie's probably got the other guy. Up stuff. Jackie got the other guy? Yeah, Jackie's on it. I do happen to know for a fact that they're. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Don't get seen by that. I do happen to know for a fact that there is an assault rifle just over here to pick up. May as well grab that. I'm not feeling the assault rifle though, I'm definitely feeling the revolver here. Grab all the ammunition we can get. That's always helpful. So what we're going to do is we're going to distract this guy here. We're going to find something that grabs attention. Right. Right, so, yeah, I do know that. What we're going to do, pretty sure you can sneak through this room. Although I haven't done this. Yeah, there's a hole in this room. We can sneak through here. I'm going to come around this way. Probably a little easier to get up on him. Is there anything worth grabbing him? What? Bruh. Can you not? He's just yelling, walking right past him. <laughs> what the hell just happened? That is surely not meant to happen. Alright, let's distract the enemy here. Alright, while he's moving over, we'll go for it. Snap his neck. Nice. The body should never bend like that. Clear to go. Shit, where the hell's our target? Look around. Grab everything we can grab in here. Ah, all cleaned up. Right, job well done. Oh, mommy. I don't doubt we could be that sneaky. Alrighty. Yeah, that's not my favorite way to roll, but... Grab all that. Anyway. Uh, some computers here. Yeah, I don't really want to go through these guys' computers. They're literally like organ harvesting in here. I don't really want to know what they keep on their computers. And an ice bath. Isn't that lovely? 
Yeah, let's check the bodies, shall we? Yeah, we're looking for the woman. Uh, I guess that'll be our gal. I think I got her. Got our yep. target. We make it? She looks she like uh, she's still I moving. Find out. V, jack into our biomod. Need to know what we're dealing with. Um, oh, this does she's not in a tub look ice. good. Crammed in with another. Fuck. Like slabs of meat. Yep. Keep it together, V. If she survives, she won't remember a thing. Tiny scar on the subconscious, that's all. All right. Heard people who live through shit like this get panic attacks. Without ever knowing why. Fucking hell. You'll be sipping a glass of ice cold water. Suddenly your hands shaking. V, Jack, yeah. into her biomod. We need to know what we're dealing with. Yeah, there's probably no time for Jacking me just in. having this chatter here. You got higher priorities right now? Sandra Dorset, NC570442. Trauma Team Platinum. Platinum? Shit. Trauma should have swooped in if she sneezed. You reckon? Guessing they jammed the transmitter, Sig. Looking at a hacked biomod, firmware reconfig, or a neurovirus. Carajo, T-Bug. You ain't seeing this place. This is tubs, ice, hooks, and cleavers. Yeah, it's pretty fucked. Mm. Scott Muncher's hack, huh? Got an idea. Check her neuroport. Find a shard? Yeah, pull it. That'll be what's muting the biomod. Uh, is that a good idea? Is that, that gonna kill her? Can't we just get her out of here? We found her still breathing. Can't lose her. We need that biomod working, checking for hemorrhages, whatever. Find that shard and yank it. All right, we'll do found it. Found the shard. Removing now. Check the biomod. Anything change? Greetings, Sandra. If you are conscious, assume recovery position now. An emergency evacuation mm. unit has been dispatched and is due to arrive at your location in 180 seconds. Biomon claims oh, shit, they're gonna be here soon. That's nice. Your premium plan will cover 90% of the projected costs of your rescue and treatment. Well, that is a relief. Let's get her off that Yeah, ice. I was just thinking that. Um, you'd cover yeah, me. Look sharp, not done yet. Don't know who's out there. Locked and ready, V. Do your thing. All right, let's get her the hell out of here, guys. She is not in a good state. Flatliner. Oh. Fucking hell. B, need to know what's going on. Jackie Air Hypo, fuck, this is bad. Get us some adrenaline. Stat. Oh, he was ready. He had that shit on hand. Alright. I think. Holy oh, shit, it worked. Alright, well, that's a relief. Get her outside. Alright, we can do that. Scab rats abandoned in ship. Alright. Well. Must have seen drama. Decided to cut their losses. Yeah, fair. Alright. Trauma team is right on time. Let's go. Stand clear. Initiating security protocol. Follow all instructions. Dude, the Trauma team all has firearms. They take this shit seriously. I'm here to help her, you know? Like, come on now. They out here threaten me and shit? Five steps back. Now. Whoa, bro. The hell was that about? Kick me hard and taste as well. These guys suck. These guys are like the American control. police on steroids. NC57044242. Not nice. Screw these guys. Bro. What the hell was the taste? Oh, not the taste? Man, I stood up to like stare them down. They're like, you know what? Fuck you. Yeah, fuck these guys. I just saved that that damn girl's life, and they're out here rewarding me like that. Hey, Assholes. That hurt. Should have followed orders. I don't follow no orders. It didn't give me time to here. follow orders. Elevator gets us to the garage direct. Good work. Shit All shows right. over. A job well done. Cutting my wires now. See you in the near future. I guess yeah. we'll just uh, leave this place and place in shambles. Mind if I borrow your wheels? Oh, yeah? What thing you thinking of? I got a date with Misty, but oh. I can't take the metro. How's I gonna look for me? A date? Won't leave you right. hanging, Jack. But don't get used to it. We can help out our man, Jack. He's saving my ass, V. Thank you. If he's got a date, like, that's oh, fair enough. He just wants to borrow it for a joyride, like, you know. She's all yours. I ain't risking it, but. I'm beat as it is. He's got a date, you know? Oh, almost forgot. Should get Wakako on the hollow. Tell her the job's done. True, true. Probably gonna tell the people that we've done our job. Alright, let's call Wakako. Pick up your phone, Wakako. V, how's it 
How did it go? Our client is alive and well. Um. Yeah, relatively speaking, she'll probably be fine. Relatively well. Trauma team took her off our hands. She'll recover. Splendid. Your payment awaits you. Ready to come and grab whenever you like, even right away. But I guess home is the only place you wish to be now. This is true. The NCPD has surrounded Watson. The district is closed. God damn it. If you're to make it past the cordon, you must move fast. Thanks for the heads up. The Night City Swing Police Department is always giving me trouble like this. Words out the NCPD is gonna put Watson on lockdown. I'm gonna sleep in my own bed tonight. We better put it in fifth. Damn yeah, straight, let's Clear do it. Meet you, Kyle. I'm driving. Alright. I'll jump at the passenger seat. Let's do it. You know I'm Australian because I went to the left side for the passenger seat. That's how you can tell. All our cars have uh, the driver's seat right here. Because we're all on the left side of the road. I actually have a hard time driving in this game because I always want to be on the left side. And I keep forgetting. I'll get used to it though, I'm sure. In time. What am I looking at there? What even was that sign? <laughs> city like any other. Just bigger. Yeah, maybe. Ah, oh, chica. Not just any other city. Get you the black hand. Had to wave in. Adam Smasher. Oh, yeah? Legends are born here. See? I don't know these legends, but... I presume we will meet them. We'll learn more about them. Let's grab a tight bite. What do you say? Jackie, oh. they're locking down Watson, remember? Oh, uh, dang it. Right. Ain't got time. Seriously? Alright. Shit, we changed guns? Dang, it's not the ideal gun. Less than ideal. Let's heal up. These are the guys that we just fought. Shoot the driver, maybe. Get him out of here, dude. How did he pop out of there? Get him out of there. See you, bro. Oh, unlucky. You'll know not to fuck with us in the future. Your baby up pretty bad. Yeah. Sorry. Do what you have to do. It's okay. We can wait. Let's just focus on getting home. Yeah, look at it is what it is. Oh, I got some banging tunes. Uh, I really like the scenery out here. This track is bopping. They got some really good songs in this game. Oh, damn. The traffic stop. Watson's on lockdown to further notice. Necessary security measures. Why? Officer, ma'am. Damn, are we ever lucky we ran into you. Really? What's it that makes you so special? Uh, heart of gold. Because only somebody with a heart of gold can understand just how much I need <laughs> to get back to my girl. Your girl? Uh-huh. I'm gonna be worried sick if I don't show. I mean, I'm trying to be a stand-up guy. <laughs> Give me a chance. Wait. Mm, that's a shame. Look at him. No model citizen, maybe, but he's a good kid. He is a good kid. You can tr trust a guy like Jackie. Come on. Let them through. Jackie's our guy. But they do laugh. Okay, on your way. You All right, good toodles. evening now, officer, ma'am. You're pulling fast ones here, Jackie. She took a liking to you. She certainly did. The devotion I demonstrated grabbed her by the gun. Right. Of course. I'm loyal, staple in my affections. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah? I'm assuming. You get it. Sure. As 
a lot of high rises around this place. It's certainly a city life. Well, we made it through the traffic stop. We're in a good state. Oh, shit, man, it's a carjacking. Can we help here? Can't get out. Yeah. It doesn't look like it's doing anything. Doesn't look like your average boss. Those guys are very Save much your average badges. That's Max Tech. CPD's Apex Predators. And Tech rolls in when things fly out of hand. Dunks out there, though. Just a midday snack for him. God damn. Well, she was over. Poor bastards. Wulog! They had it coming. That guy's telling us just to fuck off. Otherwise, we're next. Okay, we can skip the ride, but we want to see the scenery, right? We want to see what our Night City has to offer. It's a pretty gorgeous design. What was it? Seven years in the making? Well worth. What about you? Not likely to make it back to Haywood. Kill me? Don't let me through. You reckon? Sure about that? Oh yeah, I'll play nice jacket. <laughs> he has to leave this whole area. He just pulled that thing about how he needs to get to his girl. And then he explains, well, look, you see, I have to drop my friend off first, but now I'm going to see my girl. Alright, like, I know before I said I need to see her, but I didn't actually specify my girl is not actually in Haywood. I just dropped my friend off first. I was borrowing their car. Tell Miss I said hi. I will. Hey, Lloyd. And Jackie's got to... He can do it, though. Jack, if anyone's going to pull it off, Jackie will pull it off, right? All right, jump down. We love them up. Jeez, Louise. Do you hate your meat? Um, body implants, huh? Team up's calling us again. Forgot earlier. A runner I know has something you could probably use. Oh, yeah. Zip in your deeds. Sweet. Praise be to me, our Father in heaven. I am getting a getting a mission from T Bug. It seems. Which promotes the use of cybernetics implants. Cybernetics yeah, implants, eh? What are these people doing? Oh, stupid gates busted again. Third time. So, really? Does this happen that often? Fix the last two. Gotta be some kind of scam. Yeah. You can have a word with the bullshit. super. Oh yeah. Total bullshit. Keep getting it fixed, and they just keep charging us. Check my weapon stash. All right, so we can store anything we want to keep in here. Uh, oh, we got a double barreled shotgun out of all that. That's nice. Always like the shotguns. All right, well, uh, I think we're gonna call it there for the first episode, guys. I think that's a good start, a nice place to call it. We did our first mission. We got to see all the backstory, and uh, apparently we're not wearing any clothing right now. Isn't that just wonderful? Have I been not wearing clothing this uh, this whole time? This whole damn time? Have I been like that? No, apparently I'm just like that when I go to the mirror. Um, Alright, I guess. Well, it is what it is. Um, I guess we'll cop it. <laughs> Nonetheless, uh, thanks for watching everyone. This is the first episode. We're going to go through the whole series as this character. We're going to see what this game has to offer. Um, stay tuned. New episodes of this will be coming out soon.